Welcome, in front of me is a OnePlus Ace 3 and today I will show you how you can hard reset this device through recovery mode. So, um, I want to start off by actually mentioning one important thing. You can do this kind of reset in order to get rid of a screen lock if you have one set that you don't know. Let's see if I have one set. No, I don't. But the process doesn't actually change whatsoever. So to start off, no matter if you have a screen lock or not, uh, you can just hold it the power button. This will bring up boot options. And from here, you want to swipe down to power off your device. I do want to quickly mention, um, I don't know if there is a global version of this device. The one that I have right here is the Chinese version. But if there is a global version, uh, when you hold the power button, it might bring up Google or Gemini more precisely. If it does, then press the power button and volume up. That should bring up your boot options then. Um, anyway, once the phone is off, you want to hold power button and volume down at the same time. And when the OnePlus logo shows up on the screen, let go of the power button, but keep holding volume down till you have the language selection. So from here, click on your desired language, that's going to be English for me, and then select Format Data. This basically shows you the randomized code uh, right here that you need to input to confirm this factory reset, and this is completely unrelated to your screen lock. So even if you have a pin or something like that, don't worry, this is not related to your pin whatsoever. It's just a kind of like a confirmation that you want to actually reset the device. And this code changes every time you actually navigate in here. So right now it's 1674 and it's no longer 1674. It's now 6773. So 6773. Now once you insert it correctly, it will give you this pop-up format data. All user data will be reset. I'm going to click on format. Okay. And once you click on okay, after the format has been completed, the device will now reboot and continue resetting itself in the background. Now, because it is continuing the reset, it will take the device just a little bit longer to uh, boot back up. Now, once the reset is finished, we'll be presented with Android setup screen. So I'll be back once that is visible for me. And as you can see, the process is now finished and you can set up your device however you like. So if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.